Hi, it's dumpster room time again. I come back from a couple of days walkabout and uh, yep, a symmetrical PC stacking. No human could possibly stack PCs like this. Um, we've got a bunch of monitors. They look at least 22 inch jobbies. They're all Samsungs. So they might be worth nabbing. Oh, there's one tower over there. Is that a, yeah, it's a HP jobby. Not sure what these are. Haven't had a look. They've got the PS2s, four USB 3s, which is sort of my go-to for, uh, yeah, they're, they're all HP, are they? Looks like they're all identical. Ugh, not again. Bloody hell. I just got rid of, in the last clear out, I got rid of like a dozen of these things, and now they're, they're back. Two, four, six, eight, ten, plus a desktop. Ugh. Jeez, someone's clearing stuff out. They've got these like uh, dodgy partition things too for the uh, Dilbert cubicles. They look like the top part of the partition there. But yep, there you go. Jeez, I don't need 10 of them. This is ridiculous. And no, I can't ship them. They cost more to ship them than, they, than they're actually worth that you can buy on eBay. But oh well, I'll take a few back. Some are really dusty. Look at this one down here. That's a shocker. Where, oh, actually, what's, yeah, that, that's a shocker. That's the front of it. So that one's missing the front panel. So I'll take the best looking ones. None of them have USB 3 on the front, I don't think. That's a bummer, yeah. So they're reasonably old. Core, core i5s, yeah, they're gonna be nothing special. I've already got like oh, three or four of these still left. The three, I think, at least still left in the lab. Anyway, I'll see what's what. Right, I'm back in the lab. It turns out that uh, three out of the ten were actually uh, Core i7. The rest were Core i5. So I nabbed the three Core i7s plus one of the Core i5s just to see what it is. And only one of them uh, had a video card. And I've just powered it up and... Wah, 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 wah. By the way, this is um, the 20... One of it, I got three... Samsung 22 inch monitors and this one's the 24 inch monitor it's the 24C650 for those uh, playing along at home but look at this um it, the PC's working but the video card's not working this is the DVI output from the video card so I've never seen anything like that before so I'll just repower that and in case there was some funny business going on and uh I did get the RAM out of uh, most, uh, most of them had RAM. Some, there were, I think, one or two that didn't have uh, RAM sticks in them, but I scored a bunch of uh, four gig. No, there it is. Yep, okay, something wrong with the video card. So I might actually take out the video card from this and uh, try the VGA output. So actually, all of them are the uh, identical 6300 model, except they have uh, different processors. They're Gen 3 uh, Core i7s or Gen 3 Core i5s. They do have a uh, integrated display port output, not as handy as the uh, DVI um, output, but they've got VGA. So I'm going to whip this uh, car. It's just a nothing burger video card in here. I'll take it out. There we go. Yeah, it's a it's a nothing burger, as I said. Um, it's uh, it's worth having lying around. It's better, maybe better than the integrated graphics, but nah. They all do seem to be uh, very dusty. So yeah, I'll take those out of the stairwell. Give them a good blow job. All right, let's try that again with the VGAs. Yeah, we're good to go. We're in like Flynn System Info. Compact Pro 6300, small form factor, Core i7-3770. Thank you very much. I can remember when I, I've still got my original video editing machine, and I, I thought that was the duck's guts when I had a 3770. But, yeah, uh, that's not too shabby at all. With um, 8 gig of memory, still a decent machine. Okay, will the next i7 work? This one's got a Windows uh, Pro... 7 sticker on it. Uh, the i5s were pro. Of course it works. <laughs> yeah, exactly the same. But, unfortunately, looks like we do have one that is dead. Um, it must be because it's upside down, so all the electrons have fallen out. Um, yeah, I rarely do I get these where they're dead. This is the other i7. Two out of three. Their power looks all right. No, what? Well, geez, they're pretty... Ugh. Pretty filthy, but uh, yeah, it's all connected, so everything looks hunky-dory. 
It's got the memories. Even if it didn't have the memories, it should power up. Like, there's just no power supply fan at all. So, I'd say that it looks like the power supply is uh, gone in that one. I love the, um, the, the hingy things. You can just lift them up and access uh, stuff. Really quite great. So... Yeah, that's a that's a pretty rare fire. There you go, and uh, two out of three uh, i sevens. Let's try the i five. Okay, this is the i five jobby once again. It is the same sixty three hundred chassis. It's booting. Of course, it works. What do we got? It'll be a Gen three i five something or other, whatever that is. And that is an i five thirty four seventy. Yeah, I think we've seen those before. So this is a uh, socket 1155. So unfortunately, like pretty much the best you can put it in here is what it's got, which is the i7. Uh, there's one slightly higher, but there's nothing in it in terms of uh, pass mark, really. So, you know, I think they're 6800 for the i7 and about 4500 or something for the i5. They're an okay machine. They're still you know, quite fine. So there were... Uh, seven of these, and I have no doubt almost all of them are working. They've got Windows 8. Uh, these have Windows 8 Pro stickers on them. I've never used Windows 8. I jumped from Windows 7 to Windows 10. And I scored four monitors, one of them 24-inch and three identical 22 inches. And a dumpster dive in pro tip for discreetness. Instead of taking your trolley down where, you know, everything you're carting around is exposed, take your wheelie bin down. And yeah, you can. They fit uh, some monitors and PCs and stuff quite nicely. Anyway, I've got three 22-inch jobbies in there. I have no doubt they work as well. There. What are they? Samsung, something or other. Here we go. Yeah, they're Samsung 22C 450s. So three 22s. 124. Another score. I have no idea what I'm going to do with them. I don't know. I could make a video wall. I've given away so many bloody monitors, it's ridiculous. Anyway, a lot of this stuff uh, does eventually find a good home. I've given away a ton of uh, computer stuff to, like, disadvantaged uh, kids' uh, organisations and uh, stuff like that. So, yeah, it doesn't go to waste, but... There you go. That's today's dumpster score. If you liked it, give it a big thumbs up. As always, discussed down below. And yes, people keep asking. I've been saying it for about a decade now. Yes, I'm in a big commercial office tower serving like a hundred different companies. And they just move offices and they decide to upgrade. And, you know, these are quite old PCs. They've probably been using them for, you know, five, six years or more, seven years or something like that. And they've decided to toss them out and they're just upgrading all these systems. All the company's going under or they're downsizing or, you know, everyone's moving to work from home. So they've got all new PCs and, and stuff like that. So, uh, yeah, a lot of this stuff just gets dumped working. I'm surprised uh, that i7 had failed. So, yeah. Anyway, catch you next time.